This is a breast biopsy with a relatively well circumscribed lesion uh, with uh, some fibrous capsule on the periphery. But in these parts, it is also in, uh, associated with infiltrative type of growth. On higher magnification, we can see that uh, this lesion is composed of relatively uniform cells uh, with uh, round nuclei with single nucleoli and a relatively voluminous granular cytoplasm. This finely granular eosinophilic cytoplasm is very important morphological clue and together, uh, together with uh, bland nuclei it is typical for granular cell tumor. These cells are immunohistochemically positive for S100 and the, uh, they are negative for cytokeratin and uh, they are thought to arise uh, from Schwann cells. So these cells have a neurogenic origin and therefore we see S100 positivity. The cytoplasm of these cells are packed with uh, lysosomes and they are responsible for these finely granular eosinophilic appearance. Some of these cells may mimic histiocytes and uh, therefore immunohistochemistry might be helpful. Most of the granular cell tumors are benign and only rare cases are associated with uh, malignant behavior. These tumors may resemble malignancy radiologically and also on the gross examination. Uh, some histological criteria for distinction between benign and malignant granular cell tumors have been proposed and they include necrosis, spindle cell morphology, which we see partly here, vesicular nuclei with <clears throat> prominent nucleoli, uh, like here, here, and here, for example, increased mitotic activity, higher nuclear to cytoplasmic ratio, and uh, significant nuclear pleomorphism. So even though we see some of these features here, most of the cells are very uniform and bland, and this is not an example of malignant granular cell tumor. The smaller cytoplasmic lysosomes are associated with these finely granular cytoplasm, and these larger lysosomes typically have a halo uh, around them. Uh, the differential diagnosis includes inflammatory lesions and invasive carcinomas with histiocyte or histiocytoid features. So macrophages would be S100 uh, negative and uh, CD68 positive, and uh, the cells of the carcinoma would be cytokeratin positive and also S100 negative. Thanks for watching.